Hello, everyone. My name is Dr. Penny Sutcliffe, and I'm the Medical Officer of Health with Public Health, Sudbury, and Districts. I'd like to take a few moments to talk a bit about COVID-19. First off, I would really like to congratulate and thank everybody for the sacrifices that you have all been making over the last two and a half months or more. You've stayed home when you've been ill. You've washed your hands meticulously. You've been teaching your children at home. Uh, you've been only going out when it's been essential. You've been keeping two meters distance uh, when you do go out. And when you're not able to do so, you're wearing a non-medical mask. All of these measures have really taken us to the good place that we are at right now. And I do think that there is very good news. In our area, I would say that we are safely at the end of our first wave of COVID-19 uh, in our service area. So this is tremendous work. We have protected our hospital and our healthcare workers. Uh, we have protected our elderly uh, population who are vulnerable in long-term care homes. People have presented for testing uh, when they have had symptoms. All of this has get, led us to the really good place that we are at right now. The good news uh, also, is, of course, is that the province is opening up. And with that, there is more testing uh, that is available to people. So even if you don't have any symptoms of COVID-19, uh, testing is available to you if you are concerned and you would like to get tested by calling and making an appointment at a local assessment center. As the province is opening up uh, and as we're able to perhaps go and do some shopping, perhaps uh, go outdoors, perhaps see people, I really want to say that I, like everybody else, want this to continue and want uh, further uh, amenities, opportunities to be outdoors, uh, to be shopping, to go about our regular lives in a normal way. Absolutely, I want that. We want the next stage of the province uh, to open up and to do that successfully in our area. I think that the key with that is that the success of that is in our hands. It is so critically important that we keep those public health measures up. So when that we go outdoors or when we are interacting with other people, uh, that we maintain two meters distance, that we continue to wash our hands, that we stay home when we're ill, and also that we get tested so that we can understand uh, the virus uh, circulation in our area. The length uh, of the end of this first wave, when we might see a second wave, I do think that depends on the actions of all of us. So thank you very much uh, for everything that you have done. Thank you for continuing uh, to take these measures, to take this seriously so that we can protect ourselves, our families, our communities, and particularly the vulnerable people in our area. Thank you.